Okay, guys, I decided to head back to the Rose Palace and see what I'm in for. Beyond this point is Lady Rosemont's room. None may pass, and I shall soundly trounce you if you attempt to pass. You won't trounce me. Bring it! Be warned that I am quite tenacious. I shan't be defeated. No harm shall befall Lady Rosemont. I'm so glad that he's not Grand Kawagamon difficult. I mean, I can already tell from the intro to the battle where it doesn't take caution. Yeah, oh my god, this guy's so incredibly weak! Not just level 7, but look at how much health I took you out just it. now! You're doing it. Oh, and I got him frozen. Yeah, what was I doing? I see, I was under Rosamond's spell, how embarrassing. I support neither the meat nor the veggie factions. I look forward to the day where you end this conflict. Awesome! And I have a mail. Digimail. Come back to town. The groundwork is now finished. I need to tell you something important about the reincarnation. Can you come over to Gigimon's house so we can go over it? Um, let me check my tamer level and my skill, my skill points. What do I want to get? Mm. I'm really tempted to get next order because none of these look particularly useful. Except for this. Slightly raises the rate of being granted status abnormalities. Occasionally raises the MP cost when your partner attacks. Oh, negates the MP cost. That looks pretty useful. But I want to go in and see what's going on. Rosemond's room. And she seems to have two helpers. It's about time you showed up. You're that human siding with the meaty trips and mucking up my plans. Well, too late. With the energy harvested from Shine Greymon, the laser's ready to fire on the Okino Wastelands. Those savage meaty troops and all of wa the Wastelands will go up in flames, but it's no fun firing it right away. I know. I'll give you one last chance. Fight me and try to stop me from firing the laser cannon. You read my mind, Rosemon. I'll get rid of you before I take down those meaty troop fools. Nice and calm. You did it. Okay. You know what? Oddly enough, I look forward to this challenge. I mean, even though I don't like Digimon that are like really, really powerful, I actually do not mind a decent battle. Watch carefully. You see, my delete program attack. It's it knocks her off the ground. Looking good. But, um, while that happens, my poison attack uh, keeps taking her... Oh, wait, wait a second. Can I do it? I can't do it. Come on, come on. Let's go for it. I want to use the finisher. Go, finisher. Yes, double finisher. Make a death and thorn whip. Ugh, it can't be. If it's come to this, I'll hypnotize you. It doesn't work on you. I see the human in that partner. You're... You have triumphed, Tamer. As promised, I will stop the laser. It's not like I hate the meaty troops anyway, and I could care less about winning this war. Thanks for stopping me. Being queen of this castle was fun, if only for a while. In exchange for this castle, I fell for that guy's smooth talk. Ah, this defeat feels like freedom. I'm so refreshed. Next, I'll try going to the city. I can't wait to see what awaits me in that new place. Oh, that guy. Give my regards to my Otismon the next time you meet, okay? What's this? Little item in the corner. Rosemont's favorite. Virtual memory foam pillow. Let's talk to this Palmon here. Lady Rosemon, well. And this Aruramon. I will follow Lady Rosemon's orders and remain here. Well, I guess if there's nothing here, I may as well go back to the city. On Mirei's suggestion. Okay, now. Actually... I do want to speak with Leomon before I head back. Yeah, so all this walking! Yay! We gotta walk! Mm. 
Sorry, guys. Gotta charge my computer. Okay. Now we can keep going. I got 100 prosperity points, and I, I don't know what that means, other than maybe the chapter will conclude. Soon. Probably. So, yeah, until we go to Leomon, I can't really say that there's much to add. Um, we got Galmon to the city, we spoke to Red Vegemon, we defeated Hercules Kabuterimon, and we beat Rosemon. Oh, and we rescued Shine Greymon as well. Ready? It's chow time! Let's see. I suppose we can go for the file soda. There we go. Oh, and one thing I've begun to understand about the triangle on the right side of the screen. Um, I think that's connected to my Digimon's life expectancy and also its Digivolution when it's several ranks down. But what I don't understand is that uh, line in the middle for both Digimon. Uh, I really don't know what it means. Uh, I'll ponder on it later. So we will go back and talk to Leomon and see what he has to say. Oh, wait a minute. We can talk to Antilamon because of the item we grabbed. Uh, the pillow. You found a useful sleeping aid, have you? Yes. A pillow. An object humans use when they sleep. Huh, I lay it under my head like this to think some people like this. Oh, this fragrance. This is Rosemont's reputed hypnotic scent. Yes, this will certainly help me slumber. You have sound judgment, human. Human wisdom, what an unfathomable thing. Hmm, it seems I must continue to associate with you. Okay. And now for Leomon. You stopped Rosemont from firing the laser? That's amazing. I wish I had seen this laser, though. That would have been awesome. Our long battle is finally over, and peace has returned again to this island. All of this is thanks to your hard work. The meaty troops... No, all of us in the Digimon and the Okino Wastelands, thank you. You are truly the savior of all meat and our friend. Now that I think about it, former allies and enemies are working together in Flodia, aren't they? The battle between the meaty and veggie troops was indeed intense, but in a way, it made all of us stronger. In that sense, the battle may have not been for nothing. Oh, yeah, of course I'll come help. Okay. Now we're going to learn about the story. Ready? Autopilot. This is everyone. Well, let's dive right in and hear how everyone's work has turned out. Thanks to all of your hard work, Flodia is now capable of launching Project Reincarnation. The town is now effectively a massive computer processor. If we insert Omega Mon's Wart D here as the core, his purification power, combined with the antivirus, should bring about a total data purge. You're gonna turn the town into a purification device? Indeed. We will load the entire digital world into the town, and after the purge, revive it as reborn data. This is, in essence, reincarnation. Where are you gonna store all that data? You can't just store a copy of all of the digital world inside the digital world itself, can you? You're right. We'll need to resolve all network gaps and migrate the data somewhere else for a time. And this is one colossal heap of data. So we'll need to move it, 
purge it and swap it back chunk by chunk. But then, won't the reborn data get infected by the BH program as soon as we restore it? There are grounds for concern, but we have no other option. Wait, there may be one other way. What do you mean? We've nearly pinpointed the address that Lucia's toy was transmitting to, Shoma Suzuki's location. Where is it? Somewhere in the digital world? No, it's in a place called the Singular Zone. What? The Singular Zone? Impossible! The Singular Zone is where the digital world's deleted data ends up. Not unlike what the human world calls the beyond. The idea that it exists at all, let alone that a human could set foot there, is pure fantasy. I was skeptical too. The facts are facts. We found a vast, essentially infinite blank space in the area that was picking up Lucia's signal. In there, we observed multitudes of formless blocks of data plus the data of a number of Digimon, and one human. Hmm. An infinite blank space, you say? If that's true, the AR plan may be closer to realization than we thought. But... An infinite space? Sounds like the perfect place to move the data to. Exactly. No need to move it piece by piece. We could migrate all the data there together at once. What about a way to access the Singular Zone? Have you found one? Once Talmon finds his head, he can open the way. Huh. My head is where it always is. I am perfectly calm. Clearly. So there should be no problem. We did it, Loosh! This is a big feat! Really? I have big feet? You complimented me. Anyway, things sure are looking brighter for us. Just have to set the plan in motion now. Koda and I can go to the server tower and retrieve the digital world's backup data. They say that everything since the inception of the digital world is recorded and stored there. There might be some important data there that we need to have reincarnated. Way to casually drop a critical mission on us. Talmon and Lush and I will go beneath the town and open the gate to the Singular Zone. What should I do? You're in charge of defending the town, Himari. Who knows when the enemy might stop by? Okay, you got it. You. We want you on the front line. You'll enter the Singular Zone, thwart Suzuki's plans, get Omega Mon's Ward D back, and save all our worlds. I like how we're not talking about Machine Dramon anymore. I mean, that subplot or whatever Got must have second. been dropped a while ago. Made my day. Made my day. Woodmon came back to Flodia. Made he knows about day. fruits and nuts. Leomon came back to Flodia. An item Made shop at the Coliseum now. And Telamon. Went to the Digivolution Dojo. Uh, I guess he's doing Made some Digivolution support. Gaoman came back to Flodia. He's gone to the Entertainment District. He's probably gonna, going to go to the Coliseum working. Rosemon came back. Wow, so many announcements. She's gone to the Entertainment District. She said she's about making something gorgeous. It's a real city now. Okay, let's check the digital mail. This is the final battle. You can get to the Singular Zone from Ruins Lake in Nine Plains. This will be the final battle. Make sure that your Digimon are ready. We're all counting on you. Oh boy, that's not being... That's no reason or cause for concern or getting nervous or anything. <laughs> Alright, uh, next video we will meet. And we will do things like this. Final battle.